In this video, I'm gonna show you a really fun exercise that we like to do that gives our horses and riders good confidence on the trail. This is one of my favorite exercises on horseback. So it's a passing game. So Nakona and I are in the rear. We're gonna go ahead and pass everybody. Passing, passing. Oh, get a big gap there. Whee! This is a great way to get horses confident about being in the lead and it's a great way to get horses confident about other horses passing. So right now the whole line is trotting and whoever passes can either trot or canter. And this is all advanced riders. So we're, you know, we're doing it trot and then canter. Go cinnamon. Nakona doesn't particularly enjoy when horses, other horses zoom past her. So this is really good for her. And I've only ridden her out here a couple times. We typically ride in the arena. This is so good. There goes Annabelle, <laughs> a little off course. <laughs> oh, we're cantering to catch up. There goes Blossom, yay, she got her right lead. Danny's on Blossom. There goes Rain. This is fun to do with all levels of riders. Nakona thinks that these bales right there are pretty scary, the first two laps were, oops, there, see, she's like, that's scary. There goes Petra, and now it's our turn. As Soon as Petra gets in the line there, then I'll zoom past her. Ready? Here we go. I'm going to be particular and ask her for her right lead. She's suddenly like, no. There we go. Good girl. Nakona is the queen of random spooks. And of course I'm riding bareback. Here comes Cinnamon again. a great way to work on your horse's straightness so every time Nakona doesn't particularly like being next to the woods so this gives me a great opportunity to work on her leg yielding off my right leg and we will turn around and do this the other way too just to make sure that we work on you know equal equalness on uh, both sides of the horse it's really important to me I always want to work one side the same as I work the other side but super good for horses who are a little bit rushy I apologize to anybody who is getting a little seasick from the bobbling around here. here comes Blossom. I think Annabelle was supposed to be next. I don't know. <laughs> oh, okay. And Blossom is the tootiest horse ever. So right there, Nakona's pushing on me with her belly on the right, so I just move her back in line. Here goes rain again. Petra. Nakona's like, why is Annabelle way over there? So I'm gonna say, I'm gonna take everybody and I'm gonna get in front of everybody and then I'm gonna take everyone in a change of direction. So I'm gonna ask for the right lead. Good girl. Hey guys, I'm gonna change direction. 
and everybody just kind of follow and then we do the same thing. There, good girl. Let me see. Nakona is going to want to push her belly to the left because, oops, again, she doesn't like having her, she doesn't like being next to the woods. on me. She's like, everybody is going faster. I want to go faster. And I'm like, no, no, keep it easy. No big deal. So good for them to do this. And then eventually they all kind of get like, well, this is no big deal. And they just kind of slow down. Right there, Nakona's like, I'm going to pass. And now I'll make her wait a moment before I do let her go. So now I'm going to ask for the left lead. There we go. Look at that pretty line of horses. We got a terrifying trampoline over there with kids. at any speed we can do it so if it's a more um, beginner rider we can have everybody walking and then you know whoever's passing trots real slow um, I do this on the trail all the time it's a really fun way to get horses just super um, flexible about other horses zooming past and them having to slow down <laughs> Annabelle's always liking to zoom she loves her favorite part is when she gets to go fast now we're gonna pass these scary hay bales up here. A couple round bales tucked into the woods. Let's see if the first time Nakona really darted to the side, but blossom. Whoop, there we go. <laughs> ah, darn it. I may have peed a little on that one. <laughs> oh, I probably shouldn't have said that on camera. Oh, she's such a baby. And I'm bareback. Well, I have a pad on. Bareback pad. Yeah. It's good. Oh, and I'm trying to get in line with cinnamon here. Nakona's like, no, I'm going that way. And I'm like, no, you're not. Just kind of taking her time. They're all kind of getting a little tired, but what a great workout. Okay, it's our turn. I think I'm gonna ask for left lead. Yes, good girl. Yeehaw! Zoom, zoom! Zoom, zoom! Like, yeah, I get to be the lead horse and be brave for a few seconds. And then she realizes that she's not as brave as she wants to be, and she's happy when other horses get in front of her. <laughs> Nakona's favorite place to be on a trail is right in the middle because she doesn't have to be the brave one in the front. Nothing will get her from behind. And it's just so funny because she's the lead horse in the herd, yet she's like a super wimp. She 
looks like there's a scary tree. Don't know if I want to get close to it, she says. She sped up right there and veered her belly to the left. So I just blocked her with my left leg and held her back a little. Okay. I don't know. We lost, we lost some people. So I think that's the end of our game. All right. We lost Tara. Yeah, thank you. All right, we got some tired horses huffing and puffing, but that was a great 10 minute workout. So fun. This is an exercise that's been so fun that we've done for many, many years, and it's helped a lot of my riders and horses gain confidence on the trail, and we can do it in a safe manner. I hope you enjoyed this video. See you in the next one. Bye. We picked up a couple of hitchhikers. Thank you.